Traveling can be both exciting yet a challenging experience uh, when facing the difficulties of getting sick. A lot of people travel to different places and they catch cold, cough, fevers because of change of place or temperature. So, in order to minimize uh, the chances of getting sick, uh, it's very important to take a proactive approach. And the proactive approach is to boost the immunity or the defense mechanism. So, today let's talk about it. Myself, Dr. Ekta. And I've done my MD from uh, West Bengal, Kolkata, and we'll be talking about immunity uh, today. And uh, talking about immunity, it is the built-in capacity of the body uh, to face the challenges or the environmental insult to establish and regulate the immune responses. So it is a built-in capacity to fight the infections. Or the environmental insults or the challenges which are coming uh, or which are which uh, which a person is exposed to and uh, talking about that what are the uh, various uh, uh, systems in our body which contributes to this immune system okay which which does this immune function in our body so first is gut that is gut associated lymphoid tissue and that contributes to about 70 to 80 percent of the uh, immune system and it is the gut microbiome which also helps in not only in the digestion and metabolism uh, uh, that digesting the food and helps in metabolism but also helps in uh, maintaining a homeostasis or a balance of the gut in order like whatever you are eating the food which you're eating it contains the bacteria in it and uh, the gut has to be really really very strong to fight that uh, bacteria in the food because that is daily uh, you are daily intake is there and the gut has to be strong enough to fight the bacteria so the gut uh, associated lymphoid tissue contributes to about 70 to 80 percent and it is the most uh, important channel or you can say that important part of the immune system and the immune responses now the second is the thymus uh, it does has some role and the, the third one is spleen, bone marrow because it contains WBCs and these WBCs are the vital cells which fight against the infections.